In the annals of history, the struggle for equality and justice has been a constant theme. From the bustling streets of Birmingham, Alabama, to the dusty roads of rural India, tales of resistance and resilience are woven into the very fabric of our shared human experience. Let's take a moment to explore two such tales, the civil rights movement in the United States and the Indian struggle against discrimination. The civil rights movement, a pivotal period in the mid-20th century, was a relentless fight against racial segregation and discrimination. Across the ocean, in the colorful landscapes of India, a parallel struggle was brewing. Caste discrimination, deeply rooted in the society, was being challenged, paving the way for a more equitable society. What binds these two struggles together is the burning desire for equality and justice. A yearning for a world where discrimination based on race or caste is a thing of the past. Today, we delve into these two historic movements that have shaped the world as we know it. In the mid-20th century, a wave of change swept across the United States. The birth of the civil rights movement was a response to decades of discrimination and marginalization faced by African Americans. Imagine a society where your rights, opportunities, and freedoms are curtailed simply based on the color of your skin. A society where segregation is not just a concept, but a harsh reality. This was the world that African Americans lived in, a world where they were treated as second-class citizens. But it was in the face of such adversity that the seeds of the civil rights movement were sown. The movement was not an overnight phenomenon. It was a culmination of years of struggle against the injustice of racial discrimination. It was a fight for basic human rights, a fight for equality, and a fight for dignity. Leaders like Martin Luther King Jr. emerged from this struggle. Driven by the principles of nonviolence and civil disobedience, King became the face of the civil rights movement. His iconic I Have a Dream speech still echoes in our ears, reminding us of the vision of equality that he fought for. But the movement was not just about its leaders. It was about ordinary people who dared to challenge the status quo. People like Rosa Parks, an African-American woman who refused to give up her seat on a bus for a white passenger. Her act of defiance wasn't just about a bus seat. It was a statement against racial segregation, a statement that sparked a revolution. The civil rights movement was a turning point in American history. It was a time of confrontation, a time of transformation, and a time of change. It was a time when people came together, regardless of their race or ethnicity, to challenge the existing norms and to fight for a fairer, more just society. This was a time of awakening, a time when the oppressed stood up and demanded their rights. The civil rights movement marked the beginning of a new era, an era where equality and justice were not just ideals, but rights that every individual deserved. Halfway across the globe, India had its own battles to fight. The Indian struggle against discrimination is a saga of resilience, courage, and an unyielding quest for equality. It's a tale deeply rooted in the labyrinth of the caste system, a social hierarchy that has persisted for centuries. The caste system, much like a pyramid, placed the Brahmins at the top, the Kshatriyas and Vaishyas in the middle, and the Shudras at the bottom. Beyond this pyramid, however, existed a group of people deemed untouchables, relegated to a life of indignity and injustice. The untouchables, or Dalits as they are now known, faced severe discrimination, barred from temples, public spaces, and even clean water sources. The stigma associated with their impurity was a burden they were forced to carry, generation after generation. But the winds of change were beginning to stir. In the heart of this turmoil rose two stalwart leaders, B.R. Ambedkar and Mahatma Gandhi, each with their own approach to dismantle this deep-rooted discrimination. Ambedkar, himself a Dalit, championed the cause of his brethren, advocating for their rights and pushing for social reforms. His efforts led to the inclusion of affirmative action policies in the Indian constitution, a significant stride in the fight against caste discrimination. 
Gandhi, on the other hand, sought to uplift the Dalits through his philosophy of non-violence and inclusivity. He coined the term Harijan or children of God in an attempt to eradicate the stigma associated with untouchability. He believed in the intrinsic worth of every individual, irrespective of their caste or creed. Despite their different approaches, both leaders were united in their goal to eradicate caste discrimination and foster a society where all individuals were treated with dignity and respect. The Indian struggle against discrimination is a testament to the power of resilience and the indomitable spirit of humanity. It's a story of how a society deeply divided by caste lines began its journey towards equality and justice. These struggles, though geographically distant, mirrored each other in their pursuit of equality. Movements are defined not just by their struggle, but also by their impact. And the impacts of the civil rights movement in the United States and the struggle against discrimination in India are truly monumental. Let's begin with the United States. The civil rights movement, with its marches, protests and impassioned speeches, led to a seismic shift in American society. It was instrumental in the passage of the Civil Rights Act of 1964, a landmark piece of legislation that outlawed discrimination based on race, color, religion, sex, or national origin. This act was a significant victory, a testament to the power of collective action. It opened doors for African Americans, providing them with opportunities in education, employment, and housing that had been previously denied. The reverberations of this movement are still felt today, shaping the discourse around racial justice in the United States. Now, let's turn our gaze to India. The struggle against discrimination, particularly the caste-based discrimination, has a long and storied history. The relentless efforts of social reformers led to the abolition of untouchability in 1950. This was a major milestone in the fight against caste-based discrimination. The Constitution of India enacted in 1950, outlawed untouchability and made it a punishable offense. It was a radical move in a society deeply entrenched in the caste system. It marked the beginning of a new era where the marginalized could reclaim their dignity. But the impact of this struggle didn't stop there. It set the stage for affirmative action policies in India, which aimed to uplift the historically disadvantaged groups. These policies have been instrumental in providing these groups with better access to education, jobs, and political representation. The impacts of these movements are far-reaching. They have reshaped societal norms, challenged oppressive systems, and paved the way for a more equitable future. They have stirred conversations, sparked debates, and inspired generations to fight for justice. These movements changed the very fabric of their societies. They remind us that change is possible, that justice can be achieved, and that a better world awaits those who dare to demand it. History often rhymes, and the parallels between these two movements are striking. Let's dive into a realm where the civil rights movement in America and the Indian struggle against discrimination overlap. Both these movements, though oceans apart, shared a common theme the principle of non-violent resistance. This is no coincidence. The civil rights movement, led by the charismatic Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., was heavily influenced by Mahatma Gandhi's philosophy of non-violence, a cornerstone of India's fight against colonial rule. These movements were not just challenges against discrimination and injustice, they were also struggles for dignity and self-respect. Both King and Gandhi, charismatic leaders in their own rights understood this. They knew that the fight was not just to change laws, but to change hearts and minds, to change how societies perceived and treated their fellow human beings. The impact of these movements on their respective societies cannot be overstated. The civil rights movement led to the end of legal segregation in America and the Indian struggle led to the end of colonial rule. But beyond these monumental changes, they also led to a shift in societal attitudes. Discrimination and prejudice did not disappear overnight. 
but these movements planted the seeds for a more equitable future. However, it's important to remember that these movements were not just about grand speeches and mass rallies. They were driven by ordinary people, people like Rosa Parks and Bimrao Ambedkar, who had the courage to stand up against injustice in their everyday lives. Their actions and the actions of countless others like them were the true driving force behind these movements. These movements, though different in many ways, teach us the same lesson, that the struggle for justice and equality is a universal one. They remind us that change is possible when ordinary people have the courage to stand up for what is right, and that the fight for justice and equality is a fight that belongs to us all. So let's carry forward this legacy because the struggle continues and there is still much work to be done. These movements, though different in many ways, teach us the same lesson that the struggle for justice and equality is a universal one. In the journey of humanity towards justice, these movements stand as beacons of hope. As we navigate the complex tapestry of the civil rights movement and the Indian struggle against discrimination, we find common threads interwoven with the desire for equality and justice. Both movements, while unique in their origins and trajectories, were fueled by the same unquenchable thirst for fairness. They were born out of the shared human experience of oppression, and they grew into powerful forces that challenged the status quo and reshaped societies. The impact of these movements transcends borders and generations. Their legacy continues to inspire individuals around the world to challenge injustices and strive for a more equitable future. This is the power of unity, the strength of collective action, and the indomitable spirit of humanity. As we look back at these historic struggles, we are reminded of the power of unity in the face of adversity and the enduring human spirit that seeks justice and equality.